welcome back on a Friday. We are cruising Connecticut this morning for the best breakfast in the state based on your votes. Can't wait to go. What an excellent way to start I out your Friday. Like, I like that. <laughs> News Ace Ryan Christopher found yep. there's little margarine for error when it comes ah. to the most important uh, meal of the day. You must be yoking at <laughs> home. Wow, we're right. full of bad nice. jokes here on the show. Hey, the chefs at O'Rourke's in Middletown, they're combining some very unique and random assortment of ingredients to create one of their signature specials. Our approach every day is today's the best. No matter what comes our way, we treat it like it's the best day. Can we chit-chat about your pants real quick? It's like being on the red carpet. Like, who are you wearing today, sir? What am I wearing today, baby? These are actually my favorite pair, right? Wearing the carnival pants in our 75th year anniversary t-shirts. Throughout history, who are some of the biggest celebrities that have stopped by Aurora? Oh, John Wayne's been here. Guy Fury was here. He came and did a segment here. Well, this will be the second most entertaining TV segment here at Aurora, second to Guy Fury, of course. Second to Guy, no, this will be more, more than Guy Fieri. That's because I'm here. So if I walk in and I order Brian's breakfast, I have no idea what's going to be in it. It's pretty much Pandora's box of breakfast. So how many ingredients are going into the creation? 10 to 12, double digits. We have a mushroom and herb risotto, sweet potato cakes, mescaline green mix, empanada, cilantro, fresh herb, poached eggs, home-baked pork loin, freshly made hollandaise sauce, always fruit garnish. Do you have to get each ingredient in one whole bite, or what's, what's the deal? Oh, you just kind of dive into it however you feel. I would suggest coming down and getting one of your own and seeing what all the fuss is about. Do people get to try on your pants? I don't know. It depends. For the right price, possibly. Not the ones you're actually wearing right now. You know, just clarify. Wow. Quite What's the meal there, time? huh? Yeah. yeah. Did you eat the whole thing? Uh, yeah, me and uh, George, the photographer, we, we kind of split it up there. But uh -huh. it's, it's, it's crazy because you think that you're going to get this Brian's breakfast, you're going to get a pancake and yeah. egg. No, it's just random every single day. So you can walk in there today, shrimp. I, I don't even know what's on the menu today. Sounds good. I got one. How do you stay so thin? Uh, the way you eat? I, I don't know. I, I just. Uh, Walk a lot to work, or <laughs> Ryan, I don't know. A lot of this. Haven't quite figured that out. All right, Ryan. Good well, stuff. earlier this week, Ryan went to the viewer voted best hot dog, seafood, and ice cream spots around the state. You can see those reports and all of his other cruising Connecticut segments on our website, WTNH.com.